you. Our next guest, very unique distinction here. He's nominated for a Nobel Prize. Joining me now from Polk County is Polk County scientist Daryl Thompson. Daryl, thank you very much for Hi, being here. Thank and, you. and you're part of the Director of Scientific Initiatives for Global Research and Discovery Group. That's correct. You should change that to Super Friends. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's much, much catchier. And also, you guys are doing fantastic work here. And we're talking going after and fighting Ebola and, and the flu. And the flu, like Ebola, kills millions every year. Absolutely. Most people, you know, we hear about Ebola because it's very, it's very scary. But, you know, cold and flu is a, is a, is a very deadly killer, too. Okay, so how does it work here? Because it's not, this is like we were talking before when Bill was uh, doing the weather. This is more than just washing hands. You're actually going after it and trying to prevent it. Yes, what we do, we're a Ford research team and we're, our job is to identify new and useful drug candidates. And we're, we're using a high throughput method. We found a natural compound that inhibits a molecule called hemagglutinin. And that's kind of like the handshake. The, the molecule actually has to attach to the host cell so it can download its genetic information and infect it. Well, this effectively inhibits it. And inhibits it works so well that it very significantly inhibited Ebola's ability to infect new cells. So what we're talking about is this thing will actually grab hold of that Ebola cell and prevent it from attaching onto something else. That's correct. There's a little bit of a pocket, almost like a handshake, and it just puts something in the hand so it cannot complete the handshake with a host cell. Now, to me, this sounds like it has other possibilities here in fighting other things. What are you working on? We're, it basically, uh, cancer signaling is the same way. And, you know, we don't, it's too early now to say anything about it, but we have initiated a, a two-year project to explore that as fast as possible. And you're from Winter Haven, correct? Absolutely. How many other people from Winter Haven right now nominated for a Nobel Prize? Uh, my, my business partner, uh, Dr. Joe Aaron's going to be here. He's, he's nominated as well with me. But other than that, that's, uh, so I guess that, that's all That's absolutely fantastic that you're in our area here. And I thank you very much for being here and doing the research that you do. Uh, you have clinical trials coming up too. When are those? Absolutely. We start uh, in Malaysia. We start uh, dengue fever uh, in about six months. All the best. When are you going to know if you win the uh, Nobel Prize? So I'm going to keep shaking uh, your hand here, too. Uh, October. I believe in end of October is when they do it. Well, when you win it, come back here. Thank you. Have Thank you very day. much. Lindsay, back to you.